Welcome to Attendee. So the first thing you need to do is make sure you have the app downloaded and installed. When you download it, it's going to open as a zip file, so to unzip it, simply double click. Now that you have this, two things may happen. Um, you, it'll either open properly or you may get a security error where it says your Mac can't open from unidentified developers. If you get this error, you can either control click and then open it, and it should work, or you can go over to your system preferences, go to security and privacy, and then over here, when it says allow apps downloaded from, make sure you have App Store and identified developers. To change it, click the lock and then it'll ask you for your password, and then you'll be able to change it, and then you'll be on your way. So after that, you can plug in the scanner, and when you plug in the scanner, your MacBook may give you um, like a keyboard pop-up. You can simply close it out. There's no need to set up anything. So when you're ready, you can go ahead and scan your ID. And then the screen will show success, and it will display the ID number right below. Okay, so when you've scanned your ID, you have two options at the end. You can either open cumulative attendance or full attendance. So cumulative attendance will show the number of absences for each person in the class, or full attendance will just show total absences. So let's go with full attendance here. So this will show absent students for today's date. So since it scanned my ID, my name won't show on here versus everyone else's name is over here. However, if you open cumulative attendance, you scan your ID again, and then you hit that, and this will show the total absences. So my name, Mudit, it's not on here, but since we run the program twice, these people have two absences next to their names. And that's it.